Hello, bacho. Let's read a given question. The question says the electric field in an electromagnetic wave is given by e equals to 5.6, 56.5 sine omega t minus x by c newton per coulomb. We need to find the intensity of the wave if it is propagating along x-axis in the free space. We have been given with the permittivity of free space as epsilon not equals to 8.85 10 raised to minus 12 coulomb square per newton per meter square. Option A given a 5.65 watt per meter square. Option B given a 4.24 watt per meter square. Option C 1.9 10 to minus 7 watt per meter square. Option D 56.5 watt per meter square. So to understand this question, we need to understand about the concept of intensity of electromagnetic wave. Intensity of electromagnetic wave. So we have already studied so uh, energy uh, the energy transfer basically hum keh sakte hain per unit time per unit area theek hai the energy passing through per unit area in unit time is nothing but the intensity so intensity ka jo formula humne uh, derive kiya that is half epsilon not e not square into c ab ye jo term hota hai yahan pe this is the average energy Average energy को जब हम multiply करेंगे C से, so we get the value of intensity of electromagnetic wave. ठीक है? So this is the energy passing per unit area per unit time. अब यहाँ पे we need to understand के ये result use करना है। Also we need to have an idea के जो electric field का equation होता है generally, वो होता है E equals to E naught sine omega t minus of k x के form का, that we have already studied, right? अब यहाँ पे we can see के E naught is the maximum value और the peak value of electric field, so ये equation समय पता होने चाहिए और also यहाँ पे we have to have a basic understanding यहाँ पे negative sign show कर रहा है के electric field की जो propagation direction है wave का that is in the positive x axis, ठीक है ये x axis में move कर रही है wave and it is in the positive x axis, negative sign यहाँ पे ये show कर रहा है, so this is the basic thing we need to be clear with अब यहाँ पे जो क्वेश्चन में गिवन है ऑन कंपैरिंग विद अ जनरल एक्सप्रेशन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड हम ई नॉट की वैल्यू निकाल सकते हैं ई नॉट क्या आएगा 56.5 न्यूटन पर कुलम ठीक है नाउ वी कैन से इंटेंसिटी क्या आ जाएगा हाफ इनटू एप्सिलन नॉट एप्सिलन नॉट गिवन है वह 8.85 10 रेस्ट टू माइनस ऑफ 12 इनटू � E naught is this to C is this, right? तो इसको जब हम resolve कर लेंगे, तो we have the value as equal to ten raised to minus four, and this value comes out. And we have to be careful. ये square है यहाँ पे, ठीक है? तो on simplification, this value comes out to be four two three seven seven. Into 10 raised to minus 4 watt per meter square. ठीक है, so ये result आएगा हमारे पास 4.24 watt per meter square. अच्छा है watt per meter square में one might get confused क्या unit कैसा है, so we can see कि intensity को generally कैसे define करते हैं energy passing per unit area per unit time and Energy upon time, the rate of energy transfer is nothing but power, power upon area. Power ki unit hoti hai watt, area ki unit meter square. So, is tarikhe se we will be getting the unit as watt per meter square for intensity. Agar hum ab options dekhe, to be correct ho gaya is this for this question. I hope you understood the solution. All the best.